How to be a social magnet. Welcome to Success Dose, subscribe to our channel to get your daily success dose. Might you want to have more companions? I mean genuine companions individuals who chuckle and cry with you. I am sure you do. Everyone wants to have a good social circle. Everyone likes to attract people towards themselves. All of us enjoy the attention and like being part of the conversation in groups. So this time we'll focus on a few personality traits that we would implore you to find within your inner self to succeed and become a social magnet. By the end of the video, you will be able to understand the do's in order to become a social magnet. Not just that at the end you will also find some don'ts that are to be avoided if you want to become a social magnet. So, watch this video till the end as don'ts are likely to be those which you might be already doing. So let's dive right into our tips for becoming a social magnet. The first and foremost tip is to have good listening skills. A human has two ears and one mouth, our listening should be more than our talking. Listening doesn't intend to stand by anxiously for the other individual to complete so we could talk, genuine listening is the point at which we see unequivocally the thing is being said without intruding. In the event that you can do that, I offer you a go-ahead in light of the fact that you are an extraordinary individual with great social abilities. The second tip is to control your anger. Outrage is a method of communicating your refusal for a condition. Recall that blowing up is all in your mind. Individuals appreciate the organization of the individuals who make them snicker and glad. People hate the organization of irate individuals. No furious manager at any point succeeds. No irate instructor at any point is tuned in to buy his or her students. No irate parent at any point is adored by his or her kids. Similarly you are more likely to make irrational decisions when angry. So, try to remain as calmer as possible. The third quality of a social magnet is that they see good in people. Seeing the positive qualities in individuals is definitely not a simple errand. It requires genuineness, receptiveness, resistance, and a comprehension of the reasons for one's own contemplations. Bias is a dictator, so assuming you can cut the throat of bias, you without a doubt can see the positive qualities in individuals. As opposed to being a scrounger and taking care of their shortcomings. You cannot genuinely see the positive qualities in individuals without seeing the positive qualities in yourself, the law of cause and effect. To accomplish something outwardly it must be done on the inside first. You will rarely feed a pet if you are starving, so you should feed yourself first with respect and sincerity consequently you will be able to feed others. Moving to the fourth tip to become a social magnet, which is do not argue for the sake of arguing. Contending is a psychological fight, would you proceed to have a clenched hand battle with your companion ordinarily? I'm certain you won't, at that point why you wouldn't fret about having a psychological fight? As I would like to think, mental injury is more regrettable than the actual injury. Similarly, as an actual injury would harm the skin and leave a scar, even contentions can cause mental scars which can hardly be healed. So it's smarter to keep away from contention at whatever point you feel that it is going to start. At number 5, a social magnet proves to be a sincere individual. Sincerity is the hardest and the most remunerating social expertise, since like attracts like. If you truly and sincerely care for the welfare of the other person whom you are interacting with, she slash he will definitely have a preferring towards you. The sixth quality of a social magnet is that they have confidence. Individuals are pulled into other people who have immovable confidence. Not the fake weary confidence that can, without much of a stretch, be spotted. Confidence comes from one's very own individual's comprehension self. Lack of confidence leads a person to ambiguity and confusion in his or her speech. It results in deviating people away from you. Therefore, confidence is a must-to-have in order to become a social magnet. The seventh important tip is to be consistent. Individuals are pulled into the individuals who are consistent in their activities. In the event that you make proper acquaintance with an individual one day and a day or two ago you don't, you are bound to be far off from that individual. If you make a consistent effort to socialize you'll end up having many friends just like if you watch our videos regularly and consistently you'll become successful in every aspect of your life. 
We would like to remind you that watch this video till the end as, at the end of the video we are going to discuss those factors that you might be doing, which are affecting your social life adversely. Also, subscribe to Success Dose. Because, our regular Success Dose will turn your life upside down. By making you successful. So hurry up. Subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon. On number 8 is another very important habit which is T.O. Smile. In the event that you take a look at old Buddha figures, they normally show a serene smile. It's a sort of visual instruction, in light of the fact that when we smile, we become careful and get out of our distraction. Regardless of how you interface with others, make sure to smile. Regardless of whether you're associating this a this, or by means of Twitter, email, visit, Skype, or telephone, your inward and external smile will be felt by the individual you are interfacing with. The ninth habit of people with social magnet property is that they let go grudges. Do you stew over how others have treated you? It can be difficult to release yourself from negative thoughts about how someone harmed you or made you unhappy. Such negative thoughts are corrosive and will harden your heart. So let them go and focus on the beauty of the present moment instead. Letting go of grudges empty the preoccupied space in your heart for good things. It is good for both the mental and physical health of a human. The tenth interesting quality of a social magnet is that they are helpful. The way to make enduring friendships is to consider how you can help companions. The key inquiry is, what do they require? For instance, a companion of mine as of late lost her dad. At once, help is significant. So I've been preparing suppers for her, to make things simpler, and to tell her that I give it a second thought. So you see, how small helping efforts can make a big difference. It makes people trust you and count on you. This ultimately makes you a step closer to being a social magnet. The 11th tip to become a social magnet is to be kind. Kindness is rarely out of place. Mind you, I don't always figure out how to be nice. Yet, that is the idea of desires they are the stars by which we explore our lives. Despite the fact that they light up our way, we can never contact them. Kindness develops empathy in a person. It connects you to the vulnerable and disturbed. It is the key to people's hearts. Kindness never goes in vain and unappreciated. The twelfth and the most important tip is to be positive. Expect the best out of your circumstances. Be positive, have a positive attitude, people tend to avoid those who complain and whine too much. People accompany those who are positive and expect the best out of life. Positivity brings hope and happiness to an individual. Being positive always makes you likable in a group of people. Positivity can greatly attract the social gathering towards a person. In short, you can become a social magnet. Moving towards the don'ts of becoming a social magnet. As mentioned at the start of the video, we will now look into some big no's, which you must avoid, if you want to become a social magnet. The first thing you should avoid is criticizing people. If you always criticize people and pick up whatever they do, it is highly unlikely that they would enjoy your company. No one wants to be corrected all the time. Everyone is free to make their own choices and make their own decisions. Everyone has a right to do things their way. Our second thing to be avoided is negativity. This mindset leads a person to think minimum and react maximum. Negativity restricts productivity and happiness to come into your life. A negative person can never be optimistic. Negativity inside a person always reflects outside while sitting in a gathering. The way of talking and the content of communication, both are affected by the negativity inside a human mind. Such a mindset does not attract people towards an individual. It always does the opposite, which is it drifts people away from a person. So now you see how few do's and few don'ts help in getting people's attention. By following and practicing these few tips you can clearly become a social magnet. It only requires few personality improvements to stand out in a group. No matter what kind of a person you are, these few things are common to be adopted to become a social magnet. One thing remains identical in all, and that is the basic personality traits. Pro tip. Don't forget to follow these tactics we have taught as, 
our videos are not going to make any impact in your life unless you do so. Also, subscribe to our channel now because we'll provide you with a regular success dose. Thanks for watching.